Hi, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to change the AFK animation for your avatar when you're using GoGo Loco. It's actually not too difficult, it's going to take about two minutes. So, first thing you do, you go to your avatar and you look into the action layer in um, your avatar, double click. Now you go here and you double click AFK and AFK in it. And I'm going to be changing these three. Uh, notes. So here we're gonna put our AFK animation. I have one ready right here. So I'm gonna just drag that into the slots. And what you need to create is uh, make a new animation that's the same as your AFK animation, but make it one frame, like the initial position, and make a new animation out of that. So you can see how I have my original animation right here, and I made a one frame version. And you're going to put the one frame version in the first, in these first notes here. So I'm going to do that real quick. And now it pretty much would work. The problem is it snaps from standing or crouching or whatever to the FK animation in like a split second way too fast. And that doesn't look good. So we're going to change that. So you double click the app AFK here and you click this transition and you change the transition duration to 0.5, for example. And that's gonna take like half second to go through like standing to the um, AFK animation. It looks much nicer, much smoother. You can change the length to pretty much anything really. You can put it to one second or even less, depends what you like. So experiment, test it. And that's all, that's how you do it. So I'm going to show you also using the avatar emulator how this looks in Unity, meaning also in game. You can get the emulator in your project from Creator Companion, right here, you can see it. So I'm gonna go into, I'm gonna control save everything and I'm gonna go into play mode. It's gonna take a minute, there we go. And I'm select my avatar, I'm gonna put in the emulator. Now we have like all these things from the emula emulator that we don't need right now, but we're gonna find AFK here, this checkbox, and we check it. And you can see how the avatar goes into a new custom AFK pose. And the 0 0.5 second did exactly this, like the smooth transition into it. That's what happened. So yeah, that's how you change your AFK animation for Google Loco. One thing you can also do, you can use this um, AFK parameter. It's a global parameter. Uh, that's on every avatar by default. It's a boolean. And for example, if you want your avatar to, uh, I don't know, stop blinking or do whatever while you're AFK or close its eyes, for example, you can do that as well. And what you do is that you just manually add to whatever layer you're using, for example, the FX layer, the AFK parameter, which is the boolean, like this. And VRChat is going to recognize you're using the global parameter and you can do whatever you want with it. You can like add a layer and make a toggle even when AFK is true or false. You can do whatever you want. 